What's up, Diva? So, it's your girl, April, and this video is long overdue. I did promise to do this video, like, a few months ago, and so I finally got around to doing it. Unfortunately, it did take me a minute. I wanted to experience some of the hair that I received and see if it was well worth being featured in my favorite must-have AliExpress hair vendors video. And so, yes, this is the video, finally. So, in case you're wondering about the hair that I'm actually rocking today, this is from one of my favorite vendors. This is the second go-round with them. And actually, I just received some more hair from them, which is their Deep Wave, which is another store that they have on AliExpress. And this is Grace Hair. Their other sister store is called Angel Grace Hair. So, I will tell you this. This is, like I said, the second go-round, and this wig has been through the rigmarole. And I say it like that because I was so undecided about what I wanted to do with this particular hair. The first thing I did was I made the unit, and then I decided that I wanted to highlight it. So I highlighted it with a highlighting cap, and then I decided I wanted it lighter, so I bleached it. So there are highlights in it, as well as it's been bleached. It's been toned three times because I was like, oh, I didn't really like that tone color that it came out to be, which was really nice, but I decided I wanted it more like a reddish blonde, and so forth so the hair held up so well and it's still super duper soft um, I did change it up I did cut it a little bit but it still remains um, and I did yeah I did layer it a little bit it still remains a plus hair so when you're looking for a vendor on AliExpress the most important thing to do is read their reviews that are on AliExpress meaning from the actual customers themselves you can also look on YouTube, but sometimes I feel like those reviews are biased or, you know, they're not true to their word because sometimes the hair is given to the reviewer, like myself, um, who is a reviewer, or you can also check out people who has actually purchased the hair. But with my experience with Grace Hair, the first unit that I made was a U-part, and I bleached it twice, and the hair was their Malaysian Loose Wave, and I still wear it to this day. Um, I don't wear it as much as I would wear a full closure wig due to my hair being a little bit thinner in the front, front, so it is a little bit harder to blend. But Grace Hair is one of the best Ally Express vendors that there is on Ally Express. There are so many different vendors, but I do like their packaging because it comes packaged like this. You do get tags with their names on it. The hair is always well maintained and just well taken care of and it's always inspected beforehand. So Grace Hair is one of the vendors that I would highly recommend. Another vendor which I love and I have made so far two wigs by them is Lily Hair Beauty. I will tell you for one about them. The first unit I made was their, um, I used their Brazilian kinky curly hair now I've never been one for kinky curly hair so I did get three 16 inch bundles and a 14 inch closure I did at first make the wig and I was like oh, I'm gonna wear it dark but then I said you know what I want it to have color to it so I went ahead and I bleached it with two different types of developers two different strengths of developers and gave it all these different color browns and blondes in it and for one I don't really like to bleach curly hair because it seems to lose its curl pattern or it loosens up but with the Lily Hair Beauty it did not lose any type of curl pattern in it at all so I will say this for it to be my first kinky curly wig I absolutely love the hell out of this freaking hair like for one their customer service is so like out of this world they're amazing people they will send me messages through the whatsapp so we can communicate but they're very patient too as well and i find that really important because i have done so many reviews for so many different companies and i hate it when they see that i get their hair and they're like oh when is our video going to be up like i just got your damn hair three days ago or two days ago and you want the video up already like i'm not a robot you will get it up when it's up so with Lily hair beauty they don't do that at all and that is an a plus to me now the second unit that I made which is already posted on YouTube as well um, both of the videos are posted on YouTube is their um, Brazilian body wave hair I did get an 18 excuse me a 20 18 16 and a 14 inch closure now for one I do look at the ends for every hair so if the ends are thin at the hair I'm really not impressed but with their ends the hair was still thick at the bottom and it just was so pretty after it was washed and it styled like it was just some really beautiful hair very very pretty hair and I absolutely love their services so with them their prices are really competitive very affordable but their hair is like out of this world amazing like totally totally amazing 
Now, when I'm putting them in, well, as I'm mentioning them, there's no particular order that I'm mentioning them in. I'm just mentioning them as they come to mind because I've done so many. So if I do leave some out, I will be posting all of the uh, vendors in my description box below. The next one is Show Modern Hair. I've also made two units using their hair as well. So the first one, I never posted the video because the one young lady that worked there, her name was Cherry. She was so rude and just difficult to work with. She would come on my videos and leave really disgusting messages like, oh, you're a liar. You didn't put the video up yet. Like, like I told you, you have to give me some time. I am not about to rush for you. I don't really care if you didn't send me some free damn hair. You need to give me time. So at that point, I will tell you, I did receive some body wave hair from them and I bleached it in like a different pattern. And eventually I will put the video up. But the main important thing for me was that the hair was so soft and so silky and lustrous even after the processing that I did to it that I absolutely loved the hair. Like out of this world, beautiful. The second video, which I will be posting up, I have to edit it, is their loose wave hair. And a gentleman named Simon from that same company, Show Modern Hair, contacted me. He was so polite, just well-mannered, and really didn't care about the issue that I had prior, which was fine with me because he still was willing to work with me. So that loose wave hair that I got from them, I wear it a lot because it's so pretty. It's more on the darker side than in between like a dark brown. It seems to me like a black but it's not but it's a little bit darker but the hair is like so freaking beautiful beautiful hair the packaging that things come in is really great because they send you one of those big bags that you can zip on um, zipper clothes and you can always restore your wig in there if you're making one but they do have some really good prices and their hair is like bomb ass hair okay my mess here. The next one is Rosa Beauty Hair. And this wig, I will tell you girls this much, you have seen me rock this wig so damn much over the summer and recently as well. That is my curly hair, which was my silk based closure. And normally, the only way I wear it because it's so curly and just so pretty, I like to wear it with two cornrows. Um, a cornrow on the side and a cornrow going this way because it just looks so natural. And I really, really do love that hair a lot. I I wouldn't give that wig up for anything. Um, I can wear it for like five days straight and not need to refresh it or rewash it. The curls stay. It does. It does tangle a little bit in the nape area, and that is to be expected because it is curly hair. But the main important thing with me with that one is it's not a silky curly. It's more or less kind of like a in between coarse and silky and it's not all um, silky straight or shiny it just looks so natural now out of all the curly wigs that I have that one is my favorite because it just looks so natural and it just looks so just so real and it just suits me so well the length the curl pattern especially with the silk based closure it just gives it a totally different look and it just makes it look so realistic so I do love Rosa Beauty hair on Ally Express I've only done one video for them however I will give them this they have the best curly hair I have ever experienced thus far so with them I will say yes if you're interested in hair then check them out because they really are a good company Another vendor, which is a, a really good vendor, and I've worked with them before. Um, damn, um, it's so hard for me to remember their names. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to look on YouTube, and I'm going to look through my videos real okay, quick. Okay, so the next one, this is another one who I've done two videos for as well. The first video I did was a highlight in ombre hair, and this is from Ula Hair Products, yes. So... The first one came out so pretty. I highlighted it actually with box dye. The hair was gorgeous. Like, it was some really pretty gorgeous hair. And this was their Malaysian Virgin Straight Hair. I did have three bundles of 14, 16, and 18 and a 10 inch closure and the color came out so pretty and rich even if it was a box dye I used the dark and lovely box dye which was like the honey blonde one it has that girl that kind of resembles Beyonce so much so I used that one to highlight it on a highlighting cap and it just came out so pretty like unbelievably pretty and the hair just remained super duper soft they also are so patient and just very welcoming um, their customer service is like amazing like really amazing but their prices are so affordable so I don't really look forward to 
the customer service because if you here's my thing you could be nice to me all day and I'm pretty sure you will be because I'm doing a video for you however if you're not then as long as your hair is good I'm still going to give you a good rating for your hair but I will tell you if your customer service actually sucks um, the next one that I did for Ula Hair was the Epic Fail one, which was their Loose Wave, and I dyed it twice with some of the L'Oreal Hair Color Red, and let me tell you something, the hair is beautiful, um, I like to do two reviews, um, like two, if I get, uh, if I get to make two wigs for the same company, then that means that they have some good ass hair. If the first time around I'm not really impressed with you, then, you know, it is what it is. However, I will tell you this, the most important thing to look for, like I said, is read the reviews on their AliExpress store because those are true reviews. Some of them are. Some of them you can tell that they're really, really not, but some of them are. But you can also look for actual reviews on YouTube as well. And what I've been through some shit with different hair companies with AliExpress. I think it was the Lisa company. I'm not really sure, but that freaking hair burns up with the bleach. So I like to take the hair and and snip it and and test it before I do anything because I refuse to make a wig and it doesn't come out the way I plan. So all of the other companies that I have listed below, I will put them for you guys in case they are worth it. But I hope you enjoyed this video and these are some of my favorite AliExpress vendors that I mentioned. But for the others that I didn't because I'm running out of time, I'll post them below. So as always, stay diva and divalicious and I'll see you girls on my next video.